Hi guys, this is Heather Funner. But if you are using a Camtasia Studio or if you are using a Sony Vegas Pro, then you might and sometime encounter this problem. If uh, since you are watching this video, you may have encountered this problem. So if you have encountered a problem where the uh, where uh, you try to put the MPG MP4 file or MOV file into your Camtasia Studio and it says after some while that the file format is not supported or there are not no codecs available for this video file to be able to be edited on that software of Camtasia. The problem is not big. There is nothing wrong with the Camtasia Studio. Many just wonder if there is wrong with the Camtasia Studio and they uninstall it when I did that mistake. But this problem is with the codec. You do not have to download the codec from the website or anything. All you have to do is go to uh, your desktop or and or all programs and see uh, for apple quicktime player double click on it after you double click on it if you find that application uh, support uh, apple application support error not or uh, it says apple application support not found then that means that the apple quicktime player has crashed all you do is uninstall apple quicktime player re-download new exe of apple quicktime player then reinstall the e Apple QuickTime Player. After you reinstall the Apple QuickTime Player, you open Camtasia Studio. When you open the Camtasia Studio, then import some file. Then you will notice that the problem is solved. So here the problem is not with the Camtasia Studio, like many of them have mentioned in the support of Camtasia website. This is same problem, but I don't know how even the team of Camtasia was not able to answer this. They think that it was some big problem. It is nothing to do with your system or with your Camtasia software. It is all to do with the codec uh, with Apple QuickTime Player. All you have to do is go uninstall the Apple QuickTime Player, redownload new EXE and reinstall new QuickTime Player and then the problem is solved. And I hope this has helped you. I hope this is a lot understandable if still you haven't understood i'll still help you this worked for me it may also work for you since it worked for me so this is i hope you have this was helpful i hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching we'll meet in next video thank you